Hi, I'm Peter Kalmström of Kalmström.com Business Solutions. In this demonstration, I'll talk to you about importing calendar events into SharePoint. That might be useful if you have a lot of information in an Outlook calendar that you want to get into SharePoint quickly. It might also be that you have an ICS file. ICS files are very popular, such as on the ESPN site, which is an American sports site. So see, I've gone into the Atlanta Falcons here and I can export the calendar into Outlook. And if I get that information into Outlook, it's very simple to get it into SharePoint also. So that's what I'm going to show you. So first of all, we are going to create a calendar here. I'm going to do that on my HQ site by creating a new app for the events with a calendar, of course. Let's just call them Falcons. Let's say the Contoso here are sponsoring the Falcons or something. That's an area we're going for, right? So this is, of course, very valuable if you have a lot of calendar information that you've entered anyway. So next step is I'm going to connect this to Outlook. Let's allow that. There we go. There I have my ESPN calendar, which I've already exported from the ESPN site. And there in my HQ Falcons site. So now I want to get the information. Let's switch over here to switch those over to week view and we can see them. So now of course I can drag and drop these, but a much more powerful way of doing it if you have multiple events like this is to change the view. And here's the change view. And you change that to a list and then you go into the ESPN calendar, change again to a list right there. And there I have the games. And of course now I press control A to select all of them. And I simply do control C for copy, or you right click and select copy. And then you go into the HQ site, which of course the SharePoint site, change the view again to the list, and then you simply paste all of it in there. So that's how you moved a bunch of appointments and that works for thousands. And I've even tried it on tens of thousands of appointments too from a personal calendar that somebody wanted to move into SharePoint. And so you can either just move information from Outlook or you can use Outlook as an intermediate step from an ICS into SharePoint. Let's just switch back here and look at the Falcons calendar. And if I switch back a few months here, there we go. There are the appointments now in SharePoint. Also notice that I didn't even have to refresh. It was all read automatically for me. That demo shows you how to import data from an Outlook calendar or from an ICS file into a SharePoint calendar. The key here is to switch the view into a list, copy and paste. Thank you for watching this demonstration.